Pretty in Pastel. Kate Middleton rewears mint green custom made gown as she joins Prince William to host Buckingham Palace Garden Party. The Duchess of Cambridge looked elegant in a mint green gown as she joined Prince William to step in for the Queen to host a garden party at Buckingham Palace. Kate Middleton was among a host of royals standing in for the monarch, 96, who traditionally oversees four garden parties each summer but has bowed out of this year's engagements amid ongoing mobility issues. The annual garden parties, which are held between Buckingham Palace and Holyrood House in Edinburgh, are a way for the monarch to celebrate and reward those who have distinguished themselves in public service. They require the royal hosts to spend more than an hour on their feet as they make their way through the crowd. The Queen, who will celebrate her Platinum Jubilee next week, is increasingly relying on senior royals including Prince Charles, the Duchess of Cornwall and Prince William to stand in her stead at high-profile engagements. However she has made a number of appearances over the past week, including visiting the Royal Chelsea Flower Show and opening the Elizabeth Line. She was joined by the Earl and Countess of Wessex and Princess Beatrice at the event this afternoon, where the royals chatted with invited guests, who sheltered beneath umbrellas amid the drizzling rain. The Duchess last wore the mint green gown for Prince Charles' investiture anniversary in March 2019, when she paired it with nude accessories. Today, she swept her hair, which had been carefully styled into loose waves, behind her shoulders and opted for a matching fascinator for the garden party. Meanwhile she kept her makeup neutral, with a sweep of eyeliner and a touch of blusher on her cheeks. Kate was joined by Sophie Wessex at the event, who also repeated an outfit from a previous event. The Countess opted for a stunning blue midi gown by designer Amelia Wickstead, which she previously wore to Ascot. Meanwhile Princess Beatrice wore a pretty cap-sleeved tan-colored midi dress for the occasion, which she paired with a matching headband. It is the first time the garden parties have been held since 2019 after they were cancelled due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Buckingham Palace released a statement last month revealing the Queen would not attend the annual events but did not offer an explanation. Speaking on the absence, royal expert Angela Levin said, It's a good decision for the Queen not to attend garden parties as there would be too much standing. What a shame though. The annual Buckingham Palace Garden Parties, started in the 1860s by Queen Victoria, are a way of recognizing and rewarding public service and see people from all walks of life enjoy high tea on the lawn to the sounds of a military band. Every year, the Queen invites 30,000 people to attend the parties. At each garden party, around 27,000 cups of tea, 20,000 sandwiches and 20,000 slices of cake are consumed.
For the occasion men are asked to wear morning dress or lounge suits while women are invited to wear a day dress, usually with hats or fascinators. Three garden parties will be held at Buckingham Palace in May, followed by a party at Holyrood House in August. This year there was also a Not Forgotten Association annual garden party which took place on May 12 and was hosted by Princess Anne, who is patron of the charity. The Not Forgotten Association provides entertainment, leisure and recreation for the serving wounded, injured or sick and for ex-service men and women with disabilities. The garden party for the organization, which will also be held at Buckingham Palace, will bring together more than 2,000 beneficiaries of all ages and from all services.